Hey there. It's Arbors Abroad. Today we are taking you to Morocco's Padre, Padre Gorge. Gorge. Pit stop food. Hopefully we eat fast enough to get <laughs> We'll see. Bus is there. We'll see if it takes off before we are done. Yeah, and I have my phone. Should we ask how much it's going to be before they... We should negotiate it or... Yeah, we haven't. They're actually cheaper than you think. They must have had... Combien? For... Two dollars and eight dirhams. What's in the village? Yeah. Seven dirhams each. Okay. That's fine. Yeah. Fun for this. Yeah, seriously. It's really great. Thank you. How are you going about this? Wow. Up first, trying to find a place to stay. At the top of our list for staying here in the Tadra Gorge was finding a place that allowed us to use our credit card, had a really good view, and most importantly, had a cultural experience. So that's eating the local cuisine of the Berber people. Accommodation. It's much nicer than the last one. This is so freaking cool. Time to take a shower with a view. Jason's in there showering. We like really, I, really like it here so far. Absolutely. Jay found it on Airbnb and we booked it for three nights. Three Christmas. Christmas. He, yeah, we're having Christmas here and he's so perfect. Um, when we got here, he like showed us around and then he's like, Oh, Morocco's so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. And I was like, Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
incredible. It is just so good. I wonder how, how he makes it. What's that? Like, it, the, the, everything just falls apart. Like, just yeah. And the whatever seasoning, like, how do you how how is couscous so good? Like, one time compared to different. I don't know. is, is the Taja Gorge actually as beautiful as it's said to be? Is it a real nature escape in Morocco or is it just one of those tourist traps? Let's see. There's two ways to get to Taja Gorge. You can either take a taxi or you can go by foot like we did. place worth it we say yes <laughs> yes it is a little bit more touristy than we thought it would be but overall it's actually really nice yeah it's not too like you can see like the different uh, stalls and stuff within the canyon but that's really it but it's really really pretty and I think it's more than just the gorge yeah there, there's a whole I don't know culture behind it with the Berber people who live yeah, here yeah you get to visit yeah. a nomadic place I guess yeah and we didn't, although, see the nomadic person who lives up in the mountains here. Uh, that is something that you can do if you wish to. Yeah, you could hike see. higher up than what we did. Obviously, the gorge was well worth the stop. We really, really enjoyed it, and it was really fun hiking. But one of my favorite parts, I think, of this area has been the ancient Kasbah, which is this behind me. family used to live and then they moved across the way to where we're staying now so he said we have to come and check it out and it is definitely well worth it. We would though recommend staying for more than one night um, just because it is such a cool place there's a lot to explore and it's a nice place to relax but also because of the bus schedule because you get in late if you're taking the bus from Marrakesh you get in late and then the bus leaves at you have to go into town at like 2 30 or 3 to get the bus out of here, so you really don't have a full day in the canyon. Which is kind of a bummer. So 
would definitely stay more than one night. But totally worth it. Make this on your your bucket list. Thank you. Next time, inshallah. 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 Inshallah.